As I said, we're still going to have traditional four-year colleges, but we cannot continue to graduate people in this country with degrees that do not lead to jobs. I feel very passionate about that. I, I myself owed over $100,000 in student loans when I became a senator. I still owed it. I was able to pay it off with the proceeds of my book, An American Son, now available on paperback. <laughs> and, uh, you know, it really is. I'm not joking. It's available on paperback. But here's what I believe. Before you take out a student loan, schools should have to tell you, this is how much people make when they graduate from our school with that degree. So you can decide if it's worth borrowing $50,000 to major in Roman philosophy, because the market for Roman philosophers has dramatically tightened over the last 2,000 years. And so... Senator Rubio, you've called out, quote, big companies that have connections with Washington because they can affect policies to help themselves. Many would consider sugar subsidies, which you've supported, to be the type of favoritism that you generally reject. Can you explain your position? Yeah, I'm ready to get rid of them, as long as Brazil does as well, because they're trying to destroy our agricultural system. In essence, they are deliberately undercutting the price of their agriculture, not just sugar, citrus. Why? Because if they can wipe out American farmers, they know that land will be developed. Once they build condos on this land, you can never get it back into agriculture. Now they control the citrus market, now they control the sugar market, then they can charge us anything they want. It's kind of what's happening with oil now with Saudi Arabia. They are overproducing so they can cut the price of oil because they know we can't export oil, so all we can do is sell to ourselves, and because of our own laws, by the way, not because the world won't buy it. And once they can knock out all of these people that, that uh, explore for oil and natural gas, especially oil, then they control the marketplace again. Agriculture is critically important. They don't just do this, but Brazil in particular does it to those two industries. I am prepared to get rid of that when it comes to trade with any country we have a free trade agreement with. And I'm prepared to pass a law right now that says when Brazil gets rid of its subsidies, we will immediately and automatically get rid of ours. But I'm not going to let Brazil destroy agriculture in America because we have to be able to feed ourselves.